armored soldiers. Some of Volron's former guards. Let's take them out quick before things get messy. Oh, glory unto Volron! Lay down your arms and no one has to get hurt. Silence! Traitors like you shall never walk free. I knew you were stubborn, but you don't have to be so damn dramatic. Glacial Spear. Can't let it go! Say no more! Go! Well done! Uh, I'll crush you! Uh, Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! I'll tear you apart! Will this help? Someone has to get to the toughest healing circle! Ruin smash! Let loose! I'm sorry to be far. We've all got enough on us. Yes, ma'am! Chisora! Commander of Heaven! Phoenix Cyclone! What's with the hole here? Is that supposed to be their hideout? It doesn't look like it's freshly dug, whatever it is. Maybe it's the entrance to a path to Cislodia. <sighs> Everything all right? Hmm? Oh, yeah, I'm fine. Let's go. I don't know when it happened, but we sure are hauling a lot of stuff these days. I was just thinking the exact same thing. Glad to hear I'm not the only one. We should probably clear some stuff out, like our old weapons we're not using anymore. They must be in pretty bad shape by now. No way. Those are still good as new with a little polishing. If anything, I'd say all our armor is what's weighing us down. But that armor is also still good once you fix it up. Besides, Better to have too much armor than too little. You can trust me on that one. Well, what about all these dumb old antiques we're lugging around? If we sell those off, that should lighten our load. Simpletons such as yourself who can't appreciate the true worth of such things is how precious art vanishes from history. Pretty art's not gonna save you in a fight, man. Stop it, you guys. This is no time to... All I really meant to say is, you can tell how much we've been through by everything we're carrying around. Honestly. That's all. Oh. My deepest apologies. It appears that I may have rather overreacted. Yeah, I guess it's only natural we'd have so many souvenirs by now. I might have been out of line too. I guess all this stuff really is a sign of how far we've come together. Yeah, every little piece is its own treasure filled with memories. I think I'm getting stronger. Oh yeah? Think you could beat me at armor? Tell me, Alfin, wherever did you learn how to wield a sword? I was wondering the same thing too, actually. I'm guessing you knew how to fight before you met the Crimson Crows, right? I used to be a soldier who served a Danon master. I never saw the guy's face, but I still fought for him because he was my employer. Looking back, it wasn't all that different from being a slave. A Danon master? That must have been before the Renans brought you to Lenigus 300 years ago. You must fight using real Danon techniques, then. Really? We used to have our own sword arts? There's a lot of our own history we've lost since the Renans first invaded. It's not all magic and art. I'm sure it includes things like sword styles, too. It's incredible and also a little surreal to see those arts still survive after all this time. Not only that, but I first learned these moves while serving one ruler, only to end up turning my sword on the ruling class altogether. Pretty ironic when you think about it. I apologize if I dredged up unfortunate memories for you. Nah, we're good. It's in the past now. All we ever did in those days was stir up trouble. You're using those skills for a good cause now. It's not all bad. I suppose this is what people mean when they say that every cloud has its silver lining. Exactly! 
He's using those sword skills to make the world better. Could be a lot worse. True enough. I will stop worrying about mentioning it then. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. No wonder we couldn't manage to find them. They've been holed up here all this time, hiding. The remnants of Volron's forces. You think they were planning an ambush on Pelegian? Possibly. Then again, knowing how blind their devotion is, maybe they were just waiting. Waiting? For Volron, you mean? Even though we already defeated him? But... Yes, I suppose you're right. For these guys, that would just be a technicality. They act more like worshippers than subjects. They're probably still in denial that he was overthrown in the first place. Either that, or they were biding their time until the next crown contest. Either way, their allegiance is to their lord. Who they're convinced and expectant will return. So in the meantime, they wait patiently in preparation for the day that he finally does. That's way more than just loyalty. It's no less than total subjugation. It'll be a breeze. Get in, get out. This one's all mine. Burn! I'll finish you here and do it! it. As impressive as always. No, I mean you're even better than ever. I've never seen Sion actually look faster. I'll trip it up. I feel like me. Sword rain out! Alright! Rending flat! Any injuries? You've noticed it, haven't you? Notice what? I'm referring to Xion. I never thought you of all people would come to me about her. Yes, well, what concerns me has more to do with what machinations may be currently unfolding in secret on Lenigus as we make our way along this tunnel. And you're saying it's related to Xion in some way? Perhaps. She believed there was a good possibility that the Renis Alma may free her from her thorns. One would think after losing the Renis Alma, she would be more dismayed, and yet she isn't. Why? There is also the matter of the power that she inherited from. You heard what she said. She didn't know about the Maiden's power. Mere ignorance does not preclude her deep connection to the events unfolding around us. You recall when her thorns went rampant in Castle Del Faris. I've never seen dark astral energy manifest in such a way. I thought you said all Renans had dark astral energy inside of them. Correct. However, what Xion exhibited was far beyond what any ordinary citizen could ever possibly possess. <laughs> Let me be clear. I do not intend to cast doubt on Xion or her motives. Nevertheless, I cannot shake the feeling that there's more to all of this than what we currently know. Do you disagree? Like it could be worth something. It 
It's obvious that people used to go through here in order to get to the other realms. You think Voron really did seal it off to keep it hidden then? Seems like it. Those soldiers we encountered might have known about it, chosen to hide out here. But with the entry. Hey, when did I get popular? popular? You picked the wrong fight! Look out! I'll finish you here! Sword Alpha! Alpha. I never fit oh, wearing Dandy and Lightning! We're cleaning house! We've got flyers! I've got this! Let them! Marksman handle! Oh, All yours! These yeah, fists have got your name on them! A chain between heaven and earth! Sword Alpha! A wailing Dandy and Lightning! They're all over here for me! I'm coming, Redwell! I'm not scared! I'm totally fine! Yes, the wind. Air <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. Hi, Hoodle. Four slash. I'll take you all off. Here. Sword Rain Alpha. Your wings won't save you from me. Where are you going? Sword Rain Alpha. The airborne scoundrels. Sounds like a job for your crew. Sword Rain Alpha. Healing circle. What's this? I owe you one. Fantastic. Sword Rain Alpha. Amazing. We shut up, Law. I'm trying to focus. I was only trying to be nice. You fight better at a distance. Commander of Heaven. Phoenix Alpha. My fists are crushed. It out there. I see supplies and other signs people were living here. Even Zugal cages. Definitely looks like this is where the remnants of Volron's forces hold themselves up. Yeah. They were hiding in a place like this all along. This equipment is really interesting. You must really like it, Alfin. Be a 
more easy. Get in, get out! Strike! Reload! Reload! I'm going to go! Here's the evil! Take this! Wind natural energy! We are freaking invincible! Alvin and the others truly are strong! What about me? As impressive as always. Uh, I'm out of ammo! No, I, I mean, Come you're even better than ever! I've never seen Sion actually look faster! Don't worry! Hey! Blow them away! Blow them away. Easy! A breeze! An easy... We got some good... I can't say its appearance is to my tastes, personally. How much do they have to steal from us to be satisfied? What's that thing's purpose, anyway? Some kind of siphon that sends the astral energy the Lord's Harvest into Lenegas? Not as far as I'm aware. That said, it has become evident since the forming of the Renes Alma, as well as other recent events, that my insight may be... thin. I would, as I believe the saying goes, take what I say with a grain of salt. No, Halim. At the very least, I believe we can assume that whoever is pulling the strings behind the scenes has had this in the works for quite some time. Why is that? The people on Lenegas may have plenty of resources at their disposal, but not even they could prepare something like that in a mere month. Something of that magnitude takes considerable time, as well as a predetermined goal in mind. Then what was the crown contest for? At this stage, I think it was but one step in the greater scheme we see unfolding before us. What that scheme is exactly, I haven't a clue. For now, I believe we should keep moving. The path continues. It's quite possible it will take us all the way to Cislodia. Agreed. Let's keep moving. So Xion's thorns are dark astral energy. Rinwell, are you worried about Xion? Of course I am. But I don't know how to talk to her about it. You and me both.
Come to think of it, what happened to those four lights that fell from Lenegus along with the wedge? All four of them scattered in different directions. It's anyone's guess where on Dana they might have landed. I'm not entirely sure, but it seemed like those lights may have all been different elements of astral energy. So even though they're using the wedge to siphon off energy from Dana, they're shooting it back down to Dana as well? Why? I don't know. It all happened so suddenly. Hopefully it's not a sign of some new threat we'll have to deal with. But if that red woman has anything to do with the wedge, then what could that light... It's weird, isn't it? Oh? The red woman. Shion and Dohalim said they'd never seen her before Pelegian. Are you saying they're lying to us? No, it's not that I think they're lying, just... There has to be some reason for it, right? Well, one thing the two of them have in common is that they're both Renans. Okay, you two. Put a pin in it for now. I know that we're in the dark about a lot, but for now, let's focus on getting through these mountains. Yeah, of course. Say we fight that show. Don't get careless. Don't tell me. Where are you going? We did it. As impressive as always. You got flyers. I got this. See what I can do. All yours. Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood.
it sure got cold all of a sudden after we passed the peak. La. Yeah, we're getting close. Anything that makes battles easier is okay by me. made it to Cislodia. We need to get that bridge down somehow. It looks like we can control it from our side. Let's take a closer look. <sighs> Are you okay, Law? Hmm? Oh, fine. Just thinking. The past is a real downer. That's why I'm focused on what's ahead of me. You? Yeah. I'm going to stay the path. As long as we're all together, I know we'll be alright. Same here. Now let's get moving. Thank you. 
Oh, good. We can cross through here. My name is Alfin. We're not your enemies. Did you say Alfin? Slap me silly, it really is you! Forgetting someone? Renwell! Oh, glad to see you're doing okay. What are you guys doing out here? We're patrolling the realm. Never thought I'd bump into you all on my rounds, though. Heck, enough of me, though. What's going on up in the sky? Feels like the world's gonna end. That's what we're trying to figure out ourselves. And as it happens, I've got a big favor to ask. I had an inkling that's why you'd come back, as soon as I saw you in the distance. So you beat all the lords, huh? Damn, you really must be a hero. I just did what I had to. So can you send anybody to help Ganeth Heros? I think we can help out. I'll hit up the other resistance groups and rustle up some support. I doubt they'll have a problem with sending people once I mention it's you who's asking. Thanks. If you guys can help out, that'll give us a chance to do something about that wedge out in the ocean. Yeah, I think that's something only you guys can handle. Speaking of which, that thing's out in the middle of the ocean. How do you even plan on reaching it? by boat. We're about to go look for one. No rest for the weary, I see. Hey, what happened to that mask you used to wear? It's a long story. Let's just say I lost it. I sure never expected to run into Bregan. Cislodia's probably in good hands with him. A boat, huh? Where are we gonna find one of those? It's not the kind of thing people just leave lying around. Especially not Renans. For an Imperial power, they never have shown much interest in maritime expansion. Still, I dare say there should be the odd small vessel here and there. All well and good, but that structure's slap bang in the middle of the ocean. A fishing boat won't cut it. Let's just try to find one that won't sink us halfway out, yeah? Not that it needs to be a huge galley like Almadria's or anything. Just as well, since we've passed, let's see, literally zero huge galleys. All I know is we have to reach that thing in the ocean. Anything that might work, I say we try it. Thanks to Bregan, it seems like Ganeth Harrow's should be in good hands, at least. I wonder who they'll send to look after things. It'll be someone from one of the other Resistance organizations, no doubt. They could do a whole lot worse than someone like Doc. The knowledge of medicine would go a long way there. Wait, do you mean the old guy back in Calaglia? Ganeth Haros would be one hell of a trek from there. He'd have to get here first. My brother's old second-in-command, Lagiel, would be a perfect fit, too. Pity she'll probably still have her hands tied up with work in Menensea. Mahagsar will be the same story. They won't have the manpower as it is, let alone enough to start exporting it. Man. Everyone's still struggling to get back on their feet, huh? Knowing Bregan, he'll probably take things into his own hands. He seems like the kind of guy who enjoys a challenge. Thinking back on it now, though, it does kind of make you realize just how many people we've gotten to know in each of the places we visited. That's true. And each and every connection we forged is priceless. Anyway, we can trust Bregan to take care of things from here. Come on, let's focus on the task at hand.
amazing. It's always like this in Cislodia. Then in I don't see any enemies around here. It's finished. Hope. Isara, let's talk for a bit. <sighs> Thinking some more about how to realize your ideals? <laughs> no. Actually, I've been trying not to obsess about it as much as before. I find when I think too much about my ideals, I get hung up on the reality of things and lose sight of what's really important. I know what it's like to go hungry. To lose your family. That should be reason enough to fight for a better society, so nobody else has to. <laughs> Sorry about that. Even thinking about things will make you hungry after a while. You wait here. I'll go whip something up for you. Thanks for the food. <laughs> What's so funny? Nothing. Just impressed at how good of a cook you've become. Well, we've been on this journey for a while now, so I've had more than a few opportunities to hone my skills. Yeah, and now I have a good meal in me. There's a simple kind of happiness that comes with that, you know? One that's more powerful and convincing than complicated logic can be. That reminds me of something Law said, about how talking too much doesn't put food in people's stomachs. That sounds like Law. <laughs> but it's true nonetheless. When you get down to it, all you really need is enough food to keep you full and to be surrounded by people you love. Everything else comes second. Speaking of people you love, I haven't heard you talk about Magal much lately. Hmm. <laughs> Wow, okay. Way to make me feel like the worst sister ever. But you're right, I haven't. If I'm honest, I think it's because I finally found other people I love just as much. Whatever kind of society we end up having after this, it needs to be a place where I know you all can be happy. That's my starting point for now. Don't worry. Once I finish folding these clothes, I'll go to sleep. Let's stay safe today.
You saw it too, right? Where should I cast my line? I hope we catch something decent. Indeed. Hungry bellies are counting on this. <clears throat> this one's putting up a real fight! Disappointing. <clears throat> this one's putting up a real fight. This fish is seriously rare. Oh my gosh, that's a really rare species. This fish is being stubborn. this time. Wow, I can't believe you caught another amazing fish! Yeah, no kidding. I had no idea there was anything like that even swimming around in the... in the, uh... uh Kisara? Huh? Oh, hey, Rinwell, Alfin. Why the long face? Not happy with your hull? Are you not sure how you want to cook it? If you don't mind it being grilled, I'd be happy to do it for you. No, it's nothing like that. Here, take a look at this. It's a golden catfish. Ah, uh, a golden catfish? Is there some kind of problem with it or something? It's not like it's poisonous or anything, right? My brother Magal told me something about catfish once. 
He said, when you find a big one, it's an omen. And with a catfish this big, I'm just hoping it isn't a sign something bad's coming our way. Are catfish like that supposed to be bad omens? Not necessarily, but you know how these things go. Omens usually don't pop up to warn you of when good things are coming. Well, think of it like this. Omens just mean that change is coming. And in this case, it's change that all of us are going to bring. Totally. We're trying to overthrow the big bad Renans. If that's a bad omen for anyone, then we're going to make sure it's for them. Huh. I never thought of it like that. Then I guess you could say this fish is Migal's way of telling us that he's with us. That we can do this. We're going to build a future for Dana that's as bright as that fish. You bet we will. I think I'll try to make that new recipe with this. All right, but I'll decide how spicy it is. Uh. I've caught a good amount of fish, as it turns Thanks for waiting. Eat as much as you- Well, how's it taste? The meat is just the right texture and firmness. You can easily taste all of the ingredients that went into it. I'm impressed you can cut up such a huge fish. The basic procedure doesn't really change whether a fish is big or small. All it takes is practice. Still, I feel a little bad eating this fish. It's supposed to be a pretty rare species, isn't it? I'm the type who fishes for food first and foremost. Once I catch something, I cook it up with care so it doesn't go to waste. Don't worry, I took an imprint of it for posterity before I turned it into steak. The meat is so thick. It almost reminds me a little of beef. What's the difference? Isn't it all meat at the end of the day regardless of where it comes from? Says the guy who always complains about it not being red meat whenever we have fish. Look, as long as it tastes good, I don't care what it is. Even vegetables? I'm talking about meat! It looks thick because that's how big the fish was. There's still plenty to go around, so feel free to have more if you want it. Sure, I'll take another slice. Uh, better grab it while you can, everyone. I'll see you again tomorrow. Poodle and I couldn't eat another bite. Keep feeding him like that. He'll be too heavy to fly soon.
<sighs> what? Hmm. Mm hmm. All right. Huh? What? All right. Oh. Y you know, don't you think we're. Always good to be back in familiar territory. <laughs> well... <laughs> hmm... Oof. No. Mm-hmm. It's a big zoogle. I have a bad feeling about this. Radiant Pants! This one's mine! Time to cross blade! I'll smash you! I just need to stop! Try harder! Pain! Great! Denied! Sword Radiant Pants! in pain! I'm just getting stopped! What a relief! Take this! That's awesome! Ready! Sword Ray Alpha! Try this! Lightning arms! Charge my Should have met easily me. fatal. Just as well, I'm here to stop it. Sword Ray Alpha! Try this! Ready and ready! Ready and ready! I don't Sword Ray Alpha! I'll crush you! Lightning reflexes! Tenebrous claw! Come on, Will this help? now! Sword Ring Alpha! Hey, let's stop this! What would I do now? Sword Ring Alpha won't save you! I'm really a little... Perhaps now is the time? Take... I really don't... You, you, uh, uh, you picked the wrong fight! Sword Ring Alpha! Try this! Death Death on the wall now! Burning blood! Blending blood! Right. No further. Super Swallow Dance. Sword Ring Alpha. This is looking good. Save you. Okay, here I go. Sword Ring Alpha. This guy is mine. It's weakened. Ready? It looks like you have to see how you're going. I'm drinking. Shut up. I'll heal you all. Sword Ring Alpha. I'm sorry to be off. We've all got enough on us. Yes, ma'am. No? Sword Ray Alpha! Anything in normal is all mine! All good things come from the end. Now! This ends now! Consider yourself finished! I'll heal you all! Sword Ray Alpha! Away. Sword Ray Alpha! In a bind? There you go. I feel like me again. 
You could say that again. You guys want to rest here? Climate feels different from Menenseas. It's gotten much cooler since leaving town, though. Does that mean eyes were burning holes in us?
This could be useful. one of your friends, Hoodle? The first owl that you can collect on your playthrough friends, Hoodle? like we get to sleep with a roof over our heads.
Looks like we got another reward. I didn't realize that so many still remained. Danon Owls truly are majestic indeed. I thought the Danon Owls had all but died out myself. That's what I get for making assumptions. Just so we're clear, this place is supposed to be a secret. Yes, I'm aware. Places like these should be kept out of the public eye. It's a pity, though. With proper training, they could be made into a magnificent chorus. <laughs> what are they hooting about now? Alfin and Xion can interpret for us, right? Huh? Oh, no, I mean, it was just a lucky guess last time. Yeah? Maybe you'll be lucky twice. Go on, give it a shot. Uh, really? Well, if you say so. Ahem. <clears throat> Let's see. Listen to them. Are they really up to the task? <sighs> what do you mean? You're the one who put them in charge. <laughs> it's my responsibility to protect our friends. Stop trying to take everything upon yourself. This is what the owls are saying? Of, of course. course. Uh... I must say, though, we've found quite a number of owls. It's a testament to how much you care for Hoodle, Rinwell. Hmm. I wonder which branch Hoodle will perch on. Rinwell? Oh, nothing. Don't mind me. Well, come on. The perches are only half filled. We've got to find the rest of the owls.
Finally. If only we could have flown with the wind to get here fast. <laughs> no way. <sighs> mm-hmm. Well. That can't be. Sure. Hmm. Agreed. Mm hmm. I must say, I wasn't expecting you to be the one to spoil their reunion. Well, uh, it was the... Same with Alpha... And Shion. Too much affection can be hard to bear. In fact, you look sort of pleased, Dohalim. I have the privilege of witnessing their new start together. Few things can mar such joy. What if it were you? What indeed? Let's see what's going on around here. Yeah. Okay. Hey! <laughs> oh! Great! Oh! dwindling even as we speak. Time is of the essence. Let's hurry. I think you're making a mountain out of a molehill. Something feels odd here. Be on your guard. Seriously? <sighs> ah. Here we go! Aww. Good grief. Remind me again why we're all getting soaking wet just to find some fishing hole? Some things are better left unquestioned. Brace yourself! This one's tough! This one's mine! Where are you going? You're really, really strong, Alvin. I'm just trying to do the best. Still, reassuring to have you around. As impressive as always. Do it! Do it! Get toasty! Bird strike! Right, next one. I'm already on! Now you see what I can do! You see what happened there as you crossed me! 
shouldn't have done that. Sword ring out. In here. This will come in handy. First strike. Take this. I'll tear you apart. <laughs> Easy peasy. Ha hoodle. to have come across something a little unusual. This one's Will tough, this but we have no choice. Let me know if you need healing. Oh, Thanks, Shia. Be careful not to overdo it. I'm sorry. I'll do better. Holy lift! The sword ring up! Coming through! Ha! No! Scarlet Inferno! Take it! The picture of hell! Oh, did you hear it? Sword Rain Alpha! I will yeah. have to watch! Lightning Eat this! Alex, you should have messed with me! Healing Sword Rain Alpha! Here's the evil! I don't know what to do about you. Perhaps now isn't the time. I really don't know. I'm just getting stuck! I'll crush you! Lightning Reflexes! Tenebrous Claw! Sword Rain Alpha! I could do without this thing! Power. An astral art? My no. like Shut him down! Move out of that one! Yes, ma'am! Coming through! Ha! No! Scarlet Inferno! Say no more. I need to be stronger.
won't be easy. Don't be such a pessimist. Dragon! Tornade Alpha! Dragon! Get him! Inferno! I owe you one! Tornade Alpha! Dragon me mad! Swallow Dance! Back into the fray! Dragon! Dragon! Do it! The air voice! Astral Energy! Say no more! The heavens must be smiling. This one's tough! Sword Rain Alpha! Where are you going? That is a okay. former one! Here I go! Save you. Sword Rain Alpha! Watch for that! Just Sword Rain Alpha! 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 Sword Sword Rain Alpha! 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 No can play here! Come on, roll now! Sword Rain Alpha! This one's all mine! Can't be slow! Burn! 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 To stop you dying? Look sharp! Lightning Tiger Blade! See them? That training's paying off! If it's in the sky, it's mine! Say no more! <laughs> Am I on a roll or what? Well, look who's in a bright and shiny mood. Water! Here's 
This cavern is surprisingly big. Not to mention nice and cool, too. The way the light from the glowing stones reflects in the water, it almost feels like a dream. What, this damp and slimy place? Are we looking at the same thing? My word, this m must be the work of providence. Prova what now? It means destiny. I think it's a an exaggeration, though. This one's tough, Fire but we have no choice. Let me know if you need healing. This one's on mine. Sword Lunar Blast. 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 Lunar Blast.
Precision improving. so soon. What's this thing? I have a bad feeling about this. Stop! Stop it! Stop it! You picked the wrong fight! This one's mine! Stop it! You got the right. 
Natural energy! Full go! go! A flawless victory! What's this? Naturally! Alpha. Swallow dance! Healing so I really owe you one. Looks like it could be worth something. That enemy looks strong. I bet it looks like trouble. To Capital T. Together Where we've got going? this. There you go. That freaking does it. No, let me. Kill the alpha. Shit. I'll tear you apart. A world in trouble. Shattering the pieces. We need the first force. Sword rain alpha. Water. I'll crush you. <laughs> Lightning reflexes. Tenebrous claw. Not today! Let's go! 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 Let's go!
of wielding two at once would be double the firepower and, and plenty of style to boot what use is style when it's life or death You guys want to rest here? Alfin, do you understand what's on the line here? What? The fish, Alfin. With all these zoogles around, nobody can give them a good home. Namely, my stomach. Shion, we can't rush this. If there's a big time zoogle waiting for us, we've got to be prepared. Hmm. You've got a point. We can't let some dumb Zoogle beat us. Not with these fish at stake. I'm pretty sure we're all in it to win it here. This is a true masterpiece, no less than culinary art. Wow, that's some weird looking meat you're cooking up there. What is it exactly? That would be grilled rapig. What? Whoa there, what's the big brouhaha? It's rapig! How could you cook something with such cute little eyes? What did it ever do to you? I fail to see what the problem is. Rapigs are perfectly edible creatures. <laughs> Having said that, I do realize it's become rather rare to eat them lately. What with people increasingly embracing them as pets and companions. They definitely didn't fall out of fashion to eat because of their flavor, that's for sure. Agreed. Rapigs have tender, fatty meat. The taste can take some getting used to, but I would argue that's part of its charm. If the taste is too strong, I imagine you can either just cook it thoroughly or simmer it with some herbs to mask it. Indeed. At first I wasn't sure whether to smoke it with spices or simmer it in water, but I opted to grill it as is instead. Seriously, Dohalim? You have the weirdest tastes! That's probably because when you live the life of a lord, you grow tired of most ordinary cuisine. So you end up seeking out more unusual food. I don't know if that's good or bad. Well, putting aside what it used to be, you've gotta admit it does look pretty damn good. Meat is meat after all. That reminds me. I do believe I once read in a book about rare delicacies, how one can go about preparing an owl. Huh? 
I suppose I won't have the chance to try it anytime soon. Not with Huru, you won't! <laughs> Mind if I join you, Law? Hey, Law, about what you said before. When? You were telling me how there were things you wished you could have asked your dad. If you want, you can always come to me with your questions. What brought this on all of a sudden? Don't I already lean on you enough as it is? Still, there's plenty you would want to ask him if he was still alive, right? I mean, yeah, but... I think you'll have a hard time answering any of them, if I'm being honest. How come? I mean, the stuff I want to ask him about is, like, how we met my mom and how we won her over. Stuff like that. Uh. <laughs> anyway, not really something you can help with, right? You're right. Sorry, Law. I can't even begin to imagine how to help with that. You're telling me. I just wish there was someone experienced I could ask about this kind of stuff. Yeah, he was definitely that. Don't you think we're both getting pretty strong now? You guys ready to hit the road? I know what. I got a bad feeling about this one. Me too. Better. So, this is the one who polluted the pond. Consider this payback for all those fish. Oh, sweet. Sword Ray Alpha! Hit it where it hurts the most! Sword Ray Alpha! Alpha. I never miss! What? Yeah. Amazing. What? Will this help? I'll take out as many as I can! I'm on a roll now! Ranging star! Now I can let loose! Oh, you are gonna pay for that! I can carve through armor! This can't be happening! These fists have got your name on them! The flame inside me! Wrong fight! We got you in the 
weak. Quit pushing yourself and get behind us. We'll soon see about that! Can't get out of this! Oh, oh. 